Yo, what is good, everybody? Welcome back to another video. Hope you guys are having an awesome day filled with only positive vibes. Today, we got a great one for you guys. It is going to be a QQ9 gunsmith loadout that got me a nuke. It's going to be the first nuke of the season, but holy smokes, you won't believe how amazing this loadout was. And yes, we do have a different camera angle just because I am going to be using this camera angle for the mobile mayhem, which will be on this channel a little bit later today at 6 p.m. Eastern time. So make sure to follow me on trovo.live slash the hitman, which is a tournament. It's typically on Bobby's one, but today we're going to be doing it on my channel. But anyway, not to talk too much, let's go straight into our loadouts. All right, quick thing I want to mention. Yes, I did get the gold QQ9. I did grind it on stream. It's very, very easy. And that's kind of how I discovered this build. So first thing you want to see, this is our QQ9 build. This is everything you're going to be using. People were watching me live on stream doing this and I was tearing up. I'm actually going to do probably two footage to it. Maybe one, at least one, the nuke but maybe a second one where I almost got a nuke. But anyway, you guys can see monolithic suppressor. I was talking about this is probably the best you can have on a muzzle. Not only does the science, it also increases damage range. You do lose that on ADS speed and ADS movement speed and spread accuracy. However, it's already got pretty good mobility and also pretty good ADS speed. And I'll explain why it has good mobi mobility. You'll see with our next few attachments. We have the barrel that gives, what's it called? Uh, tactical barrel, which gives you ADS speed as well. Movement, you lose out on the vertical recoil and the bullet spread accuracy. However, this build, you kind of balance it out with all the other attachments. We have the no stop, which is also the same thing. ADS speed, movement speed. Typically speaking, if we had the skeleton stock, we might have tried it, but no stock makes it really good. You have the flinch stability, which is really, really bad. But honestly, you're going to be lasering people so fast, you don't have to worry about getting those gunfights. This run and gun kind of style, which I'll explain afterwards how it works. It is spread accuracy again and vertical recoil. However, what we decided to do is to readjust the rec recoil, the vertical recoil by adding the ranger foregrip, which also gives you the ADS bullet spread accuracy as well as the vertical recoil. And we do cancel out the ADS speed that we gained from the other perks. And then we also have the same thing from the rear grip by adding on the vertical recoil control. The biggest thing that we lose out on is the ADS bullet spread accuracy, but everything else seems to be pretty solid. And that's the build that we went. Yes, there's one thing that's different from everyone else is we do not use the ammunition. I did not want to fast reload. It's really not worth it for me. And the 30 round, I found that it doesn't work really right now. So. I decided I'm gonna have way more fun with this current build. And then finally, we have the 45 round mag, which I didn't use, but you can potentially use it instead of some of these other ones. But this is the build I was using, and holy smokes, I absolutely popped off. Now, talking about the classes that we had as well, this is the main one. You'll see some of the classes I probably was using the Vulture class just because I really wanted to get the nuke. But typically speaking, I would use Quick Fix because Quick Fix is so good because this style of gameplay is running and gunning. You're rushing in, you're super fast, you're flanking them, getting a kill, running out, rotating around somewhere else, getting one or two kills, rotating out. And this way with Quick Fix, you can re-challenge someone that fights you. Absolutely insane when I was sweating on that, but this is the one that I was using. And if you want, you can use Molly. I actually had trophy systems most of the time, but Honestly, I really, really wasn't focused on OBJ, so I didn't have smoke, but that's going to be it for now. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the rest of the video and I'll see you guys at the end. Crashing a surface where they can hurt us. I don't have no molly now. Oh my God, bro, bro. Reloading, cover me. On the shallow, underneath the shallow, far from the shallow. Doc RC, I knew you were going to steal my kill. I just knew it. Let's not talk about these score streaks, chat. They're absolutely horrendous. Oh my god, bro, I thought it reloaded. So uh, we're just gonna pretend like this is not broken, this class that I made right here, and it's not absolutely insane of a build. We're just gonna pretend like I didn't make the most overpowered QQ9 class in the absolute world right now. We're out here triple capping these people. Yeah. Reloading. And it's silence. You know? 
I got literally the fastest build in the world. I am the speed. Bro, I am 14 and 1. Wait, got RC? Where are you going? Where could you possibly be going, bot RC? Where could you possibly be going? This guy upstairs. We're just gonna try to kill this guy upstairs first. Oh my god! Chat, this gun is the definition of broken right now. Absolutely ridiculous right now. This guy capping in here, right? Wait, wait. Thank you. Where is he? Where is he? Where is he? Friendly XS1 Goliath is landing. Maybe online. Hello? Of course I got War Machine! Of course I got War Machine. Why would I not get War Machine after this? Bro, this gun is ridiculous. No recoil, best damage. I am literally the speed. Oh, I got annihilated. 27 and 3? Yo, this is actually the most cracked build I've ever done in my life. Oh my goodness. There's a guy right there. Six bullets in a dream, chat. Dream is alive, chat. Drop the loadout. You think I'm gonna reveal this loadout to you guys? Only people who subscribe to the channel can see it. This is the absolute most overpowered QQ9 build you can ever witness. Let me get one more game. Domination raid, all right. This is gonna be a good test for the QQ9. I am gonna have the Vulture class first half. If we start losing, I'll switch classes. Just because, uh, yeah, boy needs to get some nukes every once in a while. But here's the problem with me going for nukes is that I play so much more passive once I get on the spree. I am speed. Nice kill about that can kill. I'm gonna kill this guy here. It's gonna be there has to be someone coming this way. There you go. What? Cover me, reloading. What's the guy in here? 14 bullets in a dream? Dream is good. Oh my god, the Molotovs! I'm gonna lose some Molotovs, chat. I should have the guy cap B, but I was going for kills. Oh my god! Where the shock RC baits me. It didn't bait me. What? Can we get a pog real quick? Reloading. It's gonna hide the Sam turret all the way in spawn. Do we actually lose Bravo though, or like not really though? Yep, sir. Don't don't get debated. Don't get debated. Don't get debated. Almost got debated, chat. Excuse me? What was that? 
Shock RC, can you like not be a bot? That'd be great. That'd be absolutely fantastic. Shock RC has been destroyed. Come on, Shock RC. Could you like not be a bot for once? Appreciate it. We captured A. Maybe there's gonna be a guy here. Uh oh. I'm out, I'm out, I'm out. I'm out, I'm out, I'm out. Bot RC. Oh! Pog? Well. Well. Uh, well then. Didn't expect that one, chat. I'm gonna be real with you guys. All right, we're gonna switch classes after. Contact with enemy. QQ9 OP. Lol. No, they don't triple cap us. We'll be fine. Lol. This build is. Probably the craziest build I have ever done in my life. No cap. Out of all places for you to airstrike, you airstrike there. 42 and 5? I must I might say that this build is pretty good. Bro, I don't think anybody realized I was on a nuke streak. Call of Duty Molotov. It's not COD Mobile anymore. It's Call of Duty Molotov. All right, that's it for today. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, like, share, and subscribe. Let me know in the comments down below what you guys think about this QQ9 class. I absolutely love it. I was using it. I love the fast mobility. It basically has almost no recoil. It has great range. It just absolutely shreds. It was insane. But let me know what you guys think. All right, I'm out. See you guys next time. Kill it.